Hey, good morning. This is the roster Rick. So um, I had a few people contact me through social media asking me how to make vegan bread. So I'm gonna make you, I'm gonna show you guys how to make it today. Today I'm gonna be making uh, banana bread, sweet bread. And you can easily take this and switch it and tweak it to your own taste. Um, just change up the ingredients. Instead of using banana, if you wanna make a, 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 a salty bread, just, just don't put bananas. Don't put sugar, you know, just put other ingredients like salt, garlic, pepper, but I'll show you how to do it. So here, here's a step-by-step -step on how to make banana bread. The first thing you wanna do is preheat the oven. I like to cook my foods fast, so I put it pretty high. I, put, I bake it on 265 degrees, press start. That's the first thing you do is preheat the oven. Okay, so first off, I'm baking a cake, baking bread. You're gonna need some flour. This is the flour that I use right here. So you're going to need flour, baking powder, and baking soda. This, this is what I'm going to be baking in. So determine how much flour to use. Just find out what you're going to be baking in and just put it, just put it in that and pour it into a bowl. And that's it. So here's my ingredients. One cup of cane sugar, one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar, one teaspoon of baking soda, two to three teaspoons of baking powder, and 11 bananas. <laughs> so once you got all your ingredients, all you, got, all you wanna do is just take the dry stuff Add it to your flour. Just do it one by one. It really doesn't matter. As long as it gets all in there. This is the sugar. This is the apple cider vinegar. And, and then you just want to give it a stir. After everything's all mixed up, you want to add in your water. I chose water. You can use non-free dairy milk. But I don't have any non-free dairy, dairy milk to soak up, make it all fluffy. So I just use water. I just pour a little water. Pour a little water in there. Put in your bananas. After everything's all in there, then you just wanna just mix it up until all the ingredients soak up the water. And if you need more water, just easily add more water to it. You don't wanna to put too much, because if you put too much, it'll be like a liquid. It's gotta be thick. So just mix up until it's thick and ready. This is how it should look after it's done. Just like this. Once it's finished like this, just let it sit. Let the ingredients all soak up. Let it sit just for a few minutes, for like two or three minutes. So after it's been sitting for a few minutes, you just wanna put it in your baking pan. And then, in the oven we go. This thing's pretty heavy. Now once you put it in the oven, it's gonna start rising after 15, 20 minutes. So I'll check back with you in a minute. 